all right my people welcome back on to this channel thanks so much for subscribing to this channel our prayer has been that the good lord will continue to support you all in all your endeavors all right my people hmm, this is another one reaching us right now this countenance news about igboho's release well according to what i've been gathered it has been said that the lead council to the yoruba nation agitators chief sunday adeyemo igboho chief yomi aliyo San Thursday dispelled rumor of the purported release of Igbo from the Benin Republic prison. Well, onto this, Chief Aliyu, in a statement made available to journalists in Ibadan, entitled Re Purported Release of Sunday, Igbo said the news should be discountenanced. Well, the lead council stated that the purported news that Igboho is on his way to Germany is not true. Well, kindly discountenance any news about the release of Chief Sunday Adeyemo or that he is on his way to Germany. It is not true, please. Well, with the assistance of a worldwide renowned professor and um, Professor Akintoye and the uh, lawyers Falola and uh, self, we are negotiating for something more comfortable for him than prison to meet his health demand well i advise all to remain calm and uh, prayerful the statement said all right and then meanwhile no relating to the rumors of the fact that no igboho may leave the tension soon and then uh, no majority of people have no said something about the fact that Chief Sunday Igbo was about to be released, and then with what had been earlier said, he said, bearing unforeseen factor, embattled Yoruba nation agitator Chief Sunday Adeyemo, AK Sunday Igbo, who shall do to leave the tension soon. Well, according to what was gathered, a source close to him confided in the nation that negotiation for his release to get medical attention reached an advanced stage yesterday morning with a short expectation that Igboho would be left off the hook latest Thursday. All right, my people, and the majority of people actually reacted in one way or the other. Well, the majority of people have been like, are you serious? <laughs> well, and then with the news reaching us, it has been said that, no, there is nothing like that. Mm, and then, well, it's been long overdue. It's time for its release, though, what's a lot of people have actually said that hmm, even up till now, this man, we never believed he will still remain in that detention. Well, there is no need to inform general public about Igboho leaving detention. You are the one causing problem for him. All right. And then that's another one. Hmm, and it, if at all, this man is set to be released. Let him leave that place first eh, before we now no, no propagate it to the world. Because right now, this man needs to get out of that place fine. It's very important. Let all be diplomatic about this. Well, meanwhile, earlier before now, it has earlier been gathered that the ECOWAS Court of Justice had said that it has not received any matter relating to the trial of Yoruba Nation Agitator Sunday, a day more popularly known as Sunday Igboho in Benin Republic. All right, and meanwhile, the deputy president of the court, Justice Dupe Atoki, stated this at the end of the court's one-week sensitization mission to Kwara State. Atoki said the court of the 15-member West African countries only concerns itself with civil matters brought before it. Declared wanted by the Department of State Services for allegedly stockpiling harms to destabilize Nigeria, an allegation he denied, Igboho escaped to the neighboring Francophone country in July 2021. All right, so, and then, however, luck ran out of him, and then he was arrested by the Interpol at a Benin airport when he tried to board a Germany bound flight. Well, he has since been remanded in a prison in Benin Republic for over six months, where 
he is said to be facing trial for immigration-related offenses, among others. Well, asked to comment on Igboho's ordeal, Atoki said, obviously, there has been no complaint about Sunday Igboho before the court and then for all intent and then purposes the court has no idea of who sunday Igboho is and what is happening to him well the court is only concerned with matters that have been brought before it and then if matters had not been brought before it we would just be a meddlesome interloper trying to fish out issues in public domain well the deputy president of the ECOWAS court who said a total number of 583 cases had been received with 179 pending cases added that it has given rulings on 131 cases and the delivered judgment on 303 matters. Well, Atoki said that decisions had been passed on 21 cases, adding that 54 out of the pending cases are from Nigeria. The post ECOWAS court yet to receive Sunday Boho's case official appeared first on news. All right, my people. Well, a lot of things were actually being you know, talked about. Chief Sunday Igbo. Well, majority of people will not blame many people because right now, as it stands, Chief Sunday Igbo had overstayed in that detention. And then right now, many people want him out. And then in ed in whichever way they want Chief Sunday Igbo to be out. But one important thing is that in case of necessity, in fact, henceforth, if at all Chief Sunday Igbo, you want him to be out, you people should just be very careful in the manner to which you, you know make things you no know, public because it's all definitely will be affecting this said man. And all right, my people of the Dua Nation, no going back. That's what the people are actually still talking about. Well, our prayer has been that in no time Chief Sunday Igbo would be released. Well, majority of things were said of recent by Professor Banji Akintoye when they had the last meeting and then onto which he prayed for the Yoruba nation agitators not to compromise and they, a lot of people actually you know prayed for uh, Professor Banji Akintoye because he just celebrated his birthday also as at that period. All right and then as it stands right now everybody just needs to be you know prayer for there's nothing prayers cannot do though some sort of people will tell you that I beg forget prayer make we take him by force <laughs> we are no longer in that era because right now a lot of things are happening my brother don't ever try to pray for a while and then that is it and I thank God for the likes of Professor Banji Akintoye this man has said that well well, as it stands right now, we are going to win the battle even without force because the good Lord is on our side. All right, my people, and that's what it is right now. On to this one, what more can we say? Me, well, let me have your take on this, my people, and remember to subscribe for more updates if you are new on this channel. All right, thanks and God bless.